What's up guys, Troy here. Welcome back to the Pop 'em Don't Watch 'em Whiskey YouTube channel. Tonight, the premiere of our new series, it's gonna be called Whiskey Quickies. We take a bottle, we pop it, we review it, give it to you straight, no questions asked. Reviews coming at you on the Pop 'em Don't Watch 'em channel. Tonight, the inaugural episode, the first bottle of the series, the Clyde May Six Year Single Barrel Jonathan Maisano's Hand Select Barrel Pick. Excited about this one. Even got signed by the great grandson or grandson. It's it's one of them. He is uh, LC Mays. He helped Jonathan on this pick. This comes in at 102 proof, six years old, non chill filtered. So a little backstory, a little history on Clyde Mays. He served in World War II. He won a bronze star and a purple heart. He got injured in the war, came home, said, what am I going to do? Well, he became an infamous moonshiner in Alabama, actually caught, served eight months in a state penitentiary, finally paroled, and what did he do? Went straight back to the still. Then he actually became famous in Alabama. He invented the Alabama State Spirit which was whiskey, he would take whiskey, he would take um, Granny Smith apples, put it in the barrel, age the whiskey with the apples in the barrel, and that is now, to this day, the Alabama State Spirit. So this is MGP juice, this is not Alabama whiskey, um, this is distilled at MGP in Indiana. So, let's get into it, 102 proof. You can tell non-chill filter, those legs stick into the glass. Get into the nose. Oh man, sweet, sweet berries. Like a berry pie, fresh berry pie, sugar crust. And then when you get underneath all that, there's a lot of baking spices, but savory baking spices, almost like a pepper, black pepper. Man, oh, distinct, very distinct black pepper on that back end coming through. Let's get into the palate. Cheers, guys. Oh, man. That non chill filter. Great mouthfeel. Sticks to the palate. The palate almost exactly with the nose. Sweet up front, that pie crust, the berries, a little bit of citrus. And then when it hits that back end, man, that pepper and those bacon spices really hit. And it has a great finish. Um, oh man, you can really, it's still there. You can just taste that sweetness, but that black pepper really comes through on the back. So it creates a great balance with the whiskey. You have the sweet up front. You have the pepper and a little bit of savoriness on the back end. Great body on this whiskey. We'll go to my whiskey dictionary, guys. Once again, I'm telling you, go get this book. It will help you tremendously when charting your whiskey, making your notes. The whiskey changes. You go taste the bottle two months from now, go back to your notes, see if it changed. Some do, some don't. I'm going to go into my notes. So for this one, I ranked it 3.8 out of 5. It has great balance, sweet, spicy, great body with that mouthfeel. So that's our first episode, Clyde May Six Year Whiskey Quickies. Stay tuned, many more coming, and always remember, pop them, don't watch them.